Hello everyone and welcome. If you're torn between Spark email and Apple Mail, you're not alone. Uh, Spark is a feature-rich email client built for productivity, while Apple Mail comes pre-installed on every iPhone, iPad and Mac. But which one actually is better for your daily workflow? In this video, we'll compare Spark versus Apple Mail across five key areas, which is interface, productivity features, customization, collaboration and privacy, so you can decide which app deserves your inbox. And now let us begin with uh, user interface. Apple Mail is clean, simple and well integrated um, into the Apple ecosystem. It's minimalistic, maybe even too minimal for some users. Spark on the other hand offers a more modern UI with smart folders, swipe actions and color coded priorities. It supports both dark and light themes and its smart inbox automatically uh, categorizes emails into personal, notifications and newsletters. If you want a straightforward email experience, Apple Mail delivers. But if you prefer visual organization and a modern look, Spark takes the lead. Now let us talk about productivity. This is where Spark starts to shine. Spark supports email scheduling, uh, snooze, reminders, pinned emails, and even a built-in task manager. It also supports keyboard shortcuts and integrations with tools like uh, Todoist, Trello, and Asana. Apple Mail is more bare bones. You do get basic features like VIP contacts and uh, threaded conversations, but no snoozing, uh, scheduling or advanced sourcing. If productivity is your goal, Spark is hands down the better tool. Customization. Uh, Spark allows you to customize swipe gestures, set up templates for common replies and tweak your notifications on per account basis. You can even choose your default email, la uh, email layout, uh, theme and sorting options. Apple Mail offers far less control. You can customize some settings through the system preferences, but compared to Spark, it's not very flexible. So if you like tailoring your email experience, Spark wins again. So here's where Spark does something Apple Mail doesn't. Team collaboration. Spark for Teams lets you comment on emails, assign messages like tasks, and even dropped emails together in real time. Apple Mail doesn't offer anything like this. It's strictly a personal email app. If you're working with a team or handling shared inboxes, Spark is a clear winner here. Now privacy and collaboration. So Apple Mail keeps everything on your device or via your iCloud account. It doesn't collect usage data or store your messages externally. Spark is cloud-based and stores metadata on its servers. Uh, Riedel, the company behind Spark, says it encrypts your data and doesn't sell information, but privacy-focused users may prefer Apple's tighter control. In terms of ecosystem, Apple Mail works seamlessly with Siri, Handoff, and other native apps like Calendar and Notes. Spark has some integrations, but not as deep as Apple's own tools. Okay guys, now let us make a conclusion. If you value deep Apple ecosystem integration, a simple interface and maximum privacy, Apple Mail is for you. But if you want a modern email client with tons of productivity tools, customization and team collaboration, speak, Spark email is the better choice. So it all comes down to what kind of email user you are. And guys, if this helps you decide, give the video a like. And of course, let us know in the comments which app you prefer. And if you want more app comparisons like this one and productivity tips, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.